right? not getting the timing on these. Okay, it's not the same time, it's... Okay. Okay, okay. I'm learning, I'm learning. Look, look. The single to Chocobo took me forever. Barrett's theme was the worst so far. Two legs, nothing to it. Seeming like a little bit of a problem. Is that enough? Seven miss? Barely. Fucking barely. I'm getting better. I'm getting better. But it's still... It's still... Like, I don't... I can recover the seven misses. Sure. It's 27 times that I'm thinking it's at the same time, but it's bump, 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 bump. It's annoying. Pass. I got the pass. I got an A. That star is gonna have to come after this game's over. How may I be? Give me the disempower. Uh, I don't even need this disempowerment material. Could have gave me something a little bit better. Lewis melodies are all the more pleasing when played on the piano. I hope you will enchant us with even more splendid performances in time. <laughs> Do we just leave? I don't know how to get there. I need to switch, uh, one thing. I've been dying to come. Mm -hmm. How's it going? Nothing new. All right. Thanks for the business. Yep, anytime. So it's like a resort now. Well, I can already feel 
feel myself becoming one with the planet. Like it's an attraction? Weird. There are windmills everywhere. It's crazy to think this game is natural. It's just an upgrade spot, yeah. Planetology is the perfect place. Yeah. Our great mother's memories will always be here for you. Weapons, though. Just so we're clear, I only sell the customers I deem worthy. Materia. Oof. Turn your Moogle into a tickling time bomb that explodes when it leaves combat. Ooh. I mean, for now. of the veil like those before me until I was taken by Shinra now that I'm home and have repaid my debt to you I plan to serve my village once more I appreciate all that you've done for me thank you Damn. we're really gonna miss you red oh don't say that you're only making this harder I mean I wish we had more time but this is my duty I suppose it was your duty to act the old man. I wanted you to treat me as an equal, not a dog. Not a pig! Is that you, my boy? Coming! <laughs> so, was that goodbye? Nah, I'm sure we'll see him around the canyon. The real question is, why did we come here? Mm-hmm. To learn the secrets of planetology. Come on. Can't forget that materia. As for me. Ah, that will do. I'm gonna steal some shot eye if you don't mind. Then we can see the sights. Powered off for a minute. We are not made lesser for it. Our world is sustained by an unending cycle. The energy interest in Queen's blood. It has bewitched you. Be at ease. It is only natural to hear its call. Queen's blood is of the planet and for the planet. It, like all things, is part of the great cycle that connects us. You don't Indeed, say. each and every card holds within it a greater purpose, one that belies their form. Come, join me in a match that you too may glimpse the truth of our great mother. Okay. Edit, and I was gonna take out those or these. Yes. Oh, yes.
<laughs> Two Face. Uh, raise power of allied and enemy cards affect on the tiles by four. Enfeebled, lower their power by four. Do I get to choose? Yeah. Uh, excuse me. Why don't you do the top one? Weird. Belie the thorns beneath that will bleed you slowly and surely. Yeah, I still don't know who's haunting us, right? Isn't that what's happening? Too many. Remember, the cards are a link between us and the planet. If you are in trouble, reach out, she shall answer. Oh, great mother, hear my prayer. Watch over your son. Creepy. Oh, there's another one. Let's fuck it. Go. sharp teeth in this little fishy's maw. You might be the QB killer we've been waiting for, but there's only one way to find out. That's right, our audience doesn't want to hear commentary, they want to see blood. To up the ante, our challenger's opponent will be none other than your host with the most, me, Bernard. Ooh. 
Do, 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 do. I'm good. I think I got this. First try. First try. Oh, Dio, though. probably better. It's probably better. Why wouldn't you flip the top one? Why? As soon as they play that one, they'll get that one. Um... It wouldn't matter at that point then. The only choice that I would have... Raising it up by one or two. Yeah. Hey, look at that. And we win. There's too much going on with that. Talk about carnage, am I right? I'm lucky I got out of that match with my limbs intact. Today's <laughs> shark is a ferocious man-eating menace. He made a serious splash with some ruthless moves. Mm -hmm. Players the world over have got to be shaken in their boots. Something tells me this beast is about to upset the QB food chain. Better start swimming. Congratulations to you, sir, for an incredible match. Anytime. Canyon's Hell yeah. Shark. The fun never ends on this show. Stay tuned because we've got more coming your way. Need to talk to the camera guy. Hello? <laughs> Fancy running into you here. Say. How about I get a shot of you giving thanks to the planet? It's a good shot, Club. It's a nice shot. Beautiful shot. The canyon's also famous for its unparalleled view of the starry night sky. 
I made sure to bring all my night photography equipment along. Can't sleep until I've got the perfect starlit shot. Just let me know if you find any good photo spots. So expansive and enthralling. Oh. Your planet is the greatest artist. The way the shadows carve out the red stone. It's pure. Do 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 We are about to get the planetary lesson from Bogenhagen. We're about to get a huge, huge lore dump. How do? Ah, not so fast. Sorry, but visitors aren't allowed in here. You see, this is where we keep all our valuables. Why would you tell me that? Ah, not so. You see, this is where we keep all our valuables. Ah, not so. Fa you see, this is where we keep all our valuables. Why would you tell me that? Why would you tell random strangers that? Red's fast. Holy crap. <laughs> the stars. I want to see this place at night. Oh my goodness. Okay, I'm assuming it's not a grappling hook. I'm going to assume... Those are little platforms for the chocobo to like pick up in the air and keep flying. It's weird how there would be like a tower there and another tower right beside it. Crazy. Crazy cool. Whoa. Only those who have the key, as well as fellow Bugenhagen's permission, are allowed inside. Is this where you keep your valuables? If we've anything to fear, it is not our fellow man, nor any creature big or small, with whom we share our home. It is that which comes from beyond the confines of this world. That which disrupts the natural order. The other which may attempt to claim and consume the planet. And so I bid you, her children, to join hands and come together. For united, we shall never succumb to fear of celestial calamity. Damn. Troop spit backs over there. Oh, these are the friends I was talking about. <laughs> Thank you for looking after my monkey. My name is Bugenhagen. I teach planetology here in the canyon. Bugenhagen. Sorry. I know a thing or two about our world. Just there get too. that out. I doubt there's a thing or two you don't know about it. <laughs> well, it might seem that way to a child like yourself. I'm not a child anymore. I'm 48. 40 what? <laughs> <laughs> Nanaki here has a long life ahead of him. In human terms, I would say he's about 15 or 16 years old. That's more than old enough. I can protect our Vale and everyone in it. Which is more than I can say for my good-for-nothing father. <laughs> Speaking of the members of our little community, have you announced your return to one and all, Namaki? Not yet. Be right back. Mm. <laughs> but where are my manners? Please, come in and have a look around. another 
kind of sad beat in the story. I like it. I really like this area. Jesus Christ, look at this place. I swear, if there's some red moon bullshit on these walls, I'm going to flip the fuck out. Not quite. It's like telescope. I'm assuming that's like meteor type shit. What's the eye on it, though? Most different planets. I know it's red, but it has to be something like outstanding for me to flip the fuck out. I don't. I want to look. I want to keep looking. I don't want to continue yet. Are there different things to interact with here? Yeah, just the gizmos. Okay. Okay. That's a scale model of our planet and the surrounding stars. One could say the dust it's collected represents the people who live upon it. <laughs> Damn. It was deep. I never thought you could become even more enchanting. And yet... It's like you're singing to me of the planet's wisdom. Don't you worry, my dear. I'll find a way to bring out the full depths of your beauty. Cross my heart. You get attacked by a ninja, I'm sorry. While that may appear to be little more than a glistening mineral at a glance, it is in fact a crystallized collection of our planet's memories. Brrrr. Right. Even more enchanting. And yet, it's like you're singing to me of the planet's wisdom. Don't you worry, my dear. I'll find a way to bring out the full depths of your view. Oh, ho, ho. <laughs> have my devices piqued your curiosity? I want to know what you're floating on. Essential to my studies of the planet. That records fluctuations in various energies. I must ask that you handle it with care. It's a rather delicate device, you see. Reco record Wait, recordometer? It would be recordometer. No? No red body celestial planet that I see. I'm looking in, I'm looking in deep. There's one there. That just, you know, could be coincidence because there's a purple one, white one, green one. My whole thing was that in every Final Fantasy game that you play, there is a red moon, a red planet. They use the one in four spoilers. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. They use the one in Final Fantasy IV at the end of the game as a um, uh, as a vessel. They they have a sleeping society on that that planet. They're waiting for the the people on the planet for the right time to awaken them, and they realize, wow, we can't. We're just gonna take our shit and leave. So at the very end of the game, after the credits roll. You see that, that, that moon fly off into space, and it's a little bit reddish. When you look at Final Fantasy IX, no, Final Fantasy VIII, uh, the moon literally bulges up with monsters and becomes like uh, a dark reddish color, and it literally, it's called, they call it the moon's tear, and it cries onto the planet of all these monsters from the moon itself. Uh, and at the end of the game, you find that there used to be a crater on the moon like a huge like gaping hole on the moon and in uh at the end of the game after you go through like time and all this other bullshit the crater's gone it's the last scene that they show is you flying up to the moon and the crater's gone it's weird then you look at final fantasy 9 and there's two planets merging 
uh, Terra and Gaia. I think it was Terra was the one that was red. Uh, and you come to find out through the story of Nine that there's a sleeping society. Well, not a sleeping society. There's a... They don't have souls, but they're considered vessels. And it's the Zidane's people or whatever, and everyone looks the same. Anyway. <clears throat> that's why he's the monkey tail. That's why they can trance. And that's why... Anyway. There was a merging of planets in that one. And when you look at Ten, uh... Uh... There is a sleeping society there. The the Faith, right outside of Xanarkand, who just want to be put to rest. They've been in the sleeping, like in the dream for so long, they just want to be put to rest. And there's one CGI cutscene that they do use with Tifa and, uh, not Tifa, with uh, Yuna and Cloud. And they're like swimming around. And the camera, the very final shot, pans up and you see the moon rippling in the water but you also see a smaller shadow circle on top of it like insinuating there's one inside of the other right anyway long story short oh yeah and then the original game of final fantasy 7 they're on ps1 uh as soon as we show up here for the first time and then bugenhagen bugenhagen is explaining about the cosmos and everything they're shows a green planet uh fly i think it was green flying around and it has a tiny little red moon flying around it as well i don't know if that is our planet with that moon um if you do know the story of this game you do know where it goes what i'm insinuating is the people in four there is a it, it actually goes out of its way to make this a story point in Final Fantasy IV. Um, only the people with white hair, uh, Cecil, Gobels, Fusoya, uh, Tella, are able to use a move called Meteor. It's because they're a part of this society. Now, uh, Sephiroth, sleek back, uh, sleek back white hair, is able to summon Meteor, right? Uh, even though they're test tube baby, even though they were grown in the lab, they're still able to use it. So, what I'm trying to say is, if they're able to use this moon, this red planet, as basically a car to drive through space, what's stopping Sephiroth to summoning one of those moons, or even that moon itself, to this planet? The only reason, spoilers again, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. The only reason why Final Fantasy IX's, no, Final Fantasy uh, Seven PS1 Meteor is blown up and like electrified and all that, because of the rocket being uh, sent up. I'm saying, I know they're not connected. I know they're not. It's been explained that they're not. It's been confirmed that none of the Final Fantasy games are connected. But there's this little weird red moon that you see in every single game and it's just a little funky and i'm curious that if they remade this game are they gonna hint at it again are they gonna show it off again i don't know that's kind of what i'm looking around for any inkling to a red moon One second, Red. Anything upstairs? Anything at all? That right there is a type of a current generator. It harnesses the power of the wind to produce new airflows of its own. Perhaps you've encountered them before during your travels. Not yet. I'm not, I'm not just gonna take coincidence either. Like, it has to be, like, in my face, there's a red fucking moon. The lights we observe here have traveled to us. Mind your manners in front of fellow Because as of right now, 
it's just a coincidence of past games. If they include it into this game, they're saying something. Still looking at gadgets? Oh, oh, oh. You won't find a larger telescope on the planet. With it, you can see to the edge of the galaxy. There's no better view of the stars than through this scope. But the lens could do with some cleaning. My apologies. Mm -hmm. Oh no. Hold on, hold on, but there's more stuff. There, there was more stuff. There's like red over here. There's like a couple things downstairs. Damn, okay. Allows us on the surface. They said the thing. They said dirge of the planet. What we just heard didn't come from the planet, though. That was definitely the voice of a weapon. Hmm. You seem awfully sure of yourself, Miss. Because we saw them with our own eyes, too, in the Corel and Gungaga reactors. They were loud and huge. <laughs> a fascinating account. Were it true. However, such grand delusions could be a sign of Marco poisoning. Do see a doctor. Um, excuse no. me. No. Oh, oh. Yes. That would do them some good. <laughs> Judging from everything you've said, the three of you are unfamiliar with basic planetology. But it is never too late to learn. Please, come with me. Is it happening? If if they replay that scene of like Aerith like dodging the planet. The red moon. Do it. You better do it. You're afraid. You won't. You won't do it. I present to you our planetarium. While the Shinra building features the latest iteration, this particular one is my original design. Okay. Now then, without further ado. Okay. Tell me. I'm ready to learn. Tell me all the stuff. What is going on? What is happening in this game? Oh, we CGI now. To the 
great river where all intertwine and circle the planet without end. A cycle of continuous convergence and divergence. The ceaseless ebb and flow that is the life stream. An apt name, though it is as much a reservoir as it is a stream, being the sum of the planet's spiritual energy. It is the very essence of our star, the blood coursing through its planetary veins. And if ever that essence were to be entirely depleted, Mm hmm. No red moon. Oh, shut the fuck up. It's okay. I could be wrong. Of course. These are but basic principles of planetology. So you're saying that Mako is spiritual energy, which we're using up? Just so. Siphoned from the planet and processed for industry. That energy can no longer fulfill its true purpose. It is fated to fuel man's machinery, then fade away. Okay, but does it actually fade away? I mean, what if it doesn't? What if it just returns to the life stream in a different form? Is that possible? A novel theory, suggestive of a lack of understanding. Mm hmm. However, that can be Colin Tifa, dumbass. I meant education. You rang? Please escort this young lady to our seminar room, would you? Right this way. Okay. Hey, can I come? Not cloud. Leave me out for all the cool stuff. What's up? Got a question. Planet runs out of energy. It and everything on it dies, right? Yes. There any way to avoid this? Like making the spiritual energy stronger? Why are you asking me such things? Because <laughs> you have so many books. I'm sorry. I've come to realize that I'm somewhat stuck in the past. We've entered an era in which humanity exerts unprecedented influence over its environs. And as both the planet and society evolve, so too must science. And yet it seems that I cannot. Perhaps I'm much too old of a dog to learn any new tricks. Was my explanation of planetology not to your liking? You yelled at me, no. a seminar would provide a more agreeable experience. Creepy. Going the wrong way. Mm. Thanks so much for taking <laughs> such great care of Nanaki for us. Excuse me. Fellow Bugenhagen instructed me to let you take anything you think might prove useful on your journey. Check out the storeroom when you have a chance. Your secrets? Your secret secret room? 
Where's the secret secret room? Valuables. Show me valuables. Give me all of the valuables, please. Thank you. All the good shit. More good shit? Stairs that lead to... I can't go up those. Of course. Weapon? Cosmotite or damn it. Damn. <gasps> That's a weapon. Be a dope dope cloud sword. Do it. Do it. You won't. You would don't be don't be anything red thirteen. Don't be anything Tifa. Be a dope cloud sword. Kate Sith. I just got one for Kate Sith. You give me another one? It is... It is good. Alright. Gotta learn... That one first. I think I need to... Have Kate Sith in the party for a little bit. This was your valuable room. Shame. Oh, for shame. So I need to go down and across. It is getting to nighttime. Am I going to be able to see some stars? I still need to do that Chocobo uh, mini game thing. Souls in Wind have returned to the arts. It serves as both an ending and a new beginning. This village is lame. Did you know none of the materia here is even real? And don't get me started on the planetologists. Bunch of blowhards in love with the sound of their own voice. Damn. This village is lame. And don't get me started on the planetologists. So expansive. Within you all are the planet's thoughts and memories. By I heard from fellow Bugenhagen. By all means, please come and join the seminar. Follow okay. me if you would. Which would you say sure. is a more worthy person? Probably could have left with everyone else, but I get it. Wouldn't you already I feel the planet's essence will hide? You better run, I'm coming. Excuse me. I've uh, always been on the bigger side, but I've never been into physical stuff. Painting and poetry are more my thing. My old man, he he used to say it was a waste, me spending all my time indoors. According to him, a Why are you telling us? Fellow Bugenhagen sent word that you might be joining us. You are more than welcome to do so. But he was wrong. That extra energy I received from the planet, it was a blessing. Mm. And after imbuing it with my compassion and intellect, I'll give it right back. No way is that... Sorry to cut you off. I arrived. What about you, miss? You must have a story to share. Please. Me? Uh, okay. I, uh, where to begin? I fell into the life stream. 
I don't have words to describe it. Except beautiful, maybe? It was... a lot to take in. Feelings of kindness washed over me. Long-forgotten memories came flooding back. It was a warm, comforting place. But... there was also conflict. A war... between the planet and its enemies. And I can't... I mean, we can't let them win. We need the planet, and it needs us. We have to rise up, fight back, defend it from this terrible threat. Thing is, I don't know how to do any of that. And I hoped you might have the answer. I'm not criticizing planetology or anything, and I'm not trying to scare anybody either. I just... You know... <sighs> Never mind. This is all coming out wrong. <laughs> it is, yeah, yeah. Fucking crazy. Well into the live stream, do not what? be discouraged. Should you ever wish to try again, we would be more than happy to listen. What matters is that you keep challenging your beliefs. Stop doing that, and the answers will forever elude you. On that mm. note, oh. I think we should adjourn for the evening. The River of Lights is almost upon us, so let us head to the torch. The River of Lights? It, it this is... Like, this whole place... Is like, less... One with the planet and more tourist attraction. See you at the festival. I hate it. I kind of hate it. I liked it better in PS1. The first time out of the entire game, I liked the area better in PS1. It just feels like I'm at a... yeah. Like, the, this dude here is going to charge me $9.95 to, for a uh, cookie. There is no seminar. I think meditation has really... That's what it feels like, anyway. It's so great learning about planetology! If you... I ask you this. Who among you has looked inward into the universe of the soul? Just as each of us is a part of the planet, the planet is a part of us. Therefore, does it not follow that to heed the words of one's own heart is in essence to heed the words of our great mother? Thus do I urge you to hearken to that voice, that of the planet. That's better. That's better. More of that. Not... It feels like I'm about like to enter a scheme of some sorts. Just being here. Hmm. Down at the bottom. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I, mm -hmm. I joined this seminar earlier. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Fuck that shit. Do 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 do. feels less of this is like a, a way of life and deep meaningful cosmic shit being one with everything that it used to feel like and it feels more tourist attraction maybe it's just me I don't know Yeah, because before in PS1, you'd come sit at this fire at the center of the place, and it would just be the party being like, what the fuck? This, this is wild. And now, it feels like everyone paid tickets to get in here. Oh, 
when you die, you return to the planet? That has literally got to be the dumbest thing I have ever heard. Once you die, that's that. Why do you think that? I just do. I believe in anything else until I see some actual proof. Well, I fucked that up. How much longer are they gonna be doing this? Sorry, Yubi. Look at them, gathered around the fire. Just like us that day. Me, and Mom, and Dad. If only we could do that again. Uh, never mind. Just forget I said anything. I'll lend an ear. Whenever I think about my mom, my chest swells with so much pride, I, I feel like it'll burst. But when it comes to my dad, I just... Sorry, I can't. Still not ready. Hmm. Uh, feel like you fucked that up too. I had the pleasure of talking to a mentor said it was presumptuous of me to think I could save the planet. She decides her own fate, you see. As rain cleanses the skies, so too does she cleanse herself of filth. So what? We sit here and theorize while the planet rinses and repeats? No, we fight, or nothing will change. That's what I said. I knew you'd see it my way, Merc. Thanks. Damn, Barrett's still the same too. Shit. Did I sound as awkward as I felt? Just gotta laugh it off. It's that simple. Except it's not. At least not for me. Fuck that one up too. Maybe I'm too serious for my own good. Damn it. Put your faith in our great mother. She would never forsake us. Never abandon us. For we are her children, one and all. This wonderful planet is always watching over us. Ever keeping calamity at bay. If people everywhere resolved to not take her bounty for granted, and offered up prayers of gratitude. It's just not creepy at all. At all. Trying to find a good, Woman. a good position. Sorry, I, I really want a picture here. Yeah, kind of spooky. Not gonna lie, kind of spooky. Huh? Or child would suffer. We must live in a heart. Oops. Earth uh, is being indoctrinated. The shirt. So, I'm an ancient, as in a steward of the planet, one of those ancients. Or, to be more precise, the only ancient. For the most part, it's Jesus been a Christ. source of pain. I've been held against my will. I've been watched. I've been ignored. Even hated. And it's been that way ever since I was little. 
My blood's been nothing but a curse. If I ever started to forget, something would remind me of what I was and bring me crashing back down to Earth. It was always the same. Time after time. I'd be shown a glimmer of hope, only to have it snatched away. I was never gonna be normal. That much was clear. <laughs> Tried. So my blood's been a curse, but it's also been a blessing. It's brought some wonderful people into my life, friends that I love. Oh. And for once, I think I'm okay. Happy even. And all that pain feels worth it. Even if I can't lead a normal life, there is one thing I can do. Return their kindness. And try to make the most of what I've been given. So sweet. For what? <laughs> Pretty sappy, huh? This is where you've been, Nanaki. What's up? There's something of great import I need to show you. And by that, I mean more of you. Join me, would you? Hell yeah. I'm ready to go through these what caves. What you all think of the River of Light? For whatever reason, the ceremony has drawn a number of tourists to the Vale Reservoir. When I ask for their impressions, they... One second, one second, one second, one second, one second, one second. Mm. Often speak of how mm. beautiful. One second, one second, one second, one second, one second. Okay, they are the leader. It was. You for choosing Some claim they were even moved to tears. It's an overwhelmingly positive reception, I'm happy to say. To stir the human soul is no small feat. 
and it pleases me to know that the River of Light possesses such power. My hopes to parlay their emotional response into a deeper intellectual curiosity. They have yet to be fulfilled. People are surrounded by cats, dogs, birds, and trees. They know that life is all around them, be it through the birth of a baby or the blooming of a flower. They bear constant witness to the blessed cycle Dork. of creation, yet they've no interest in the welfare of our planet. <laughs> Forgive me for sharing my idle thoughts. Keeping them to myself is quite a challenge in my old age. Is it really that dark? Don't need to turn things. Oh, it's bright again. Well then, shall we proceed? Uh, sure. But I thought this door was sealed so that none may enter. Why, yes, and by my own hand, no less. However, you've a trial to undertake. I do. If you wish to prove yourself and become a watcher of the veil, that is. I presume you are prepared. Yeah. I will mm -hmm. also require your assistance in carrying out the trial. Much danger awaits within, and I wish to ensure his safety. When you're ready, simply say the word. And off we go. <laughs> now we follow the cave where it leads, deep as it will take us. Oh, there were people in here. Can I run yet? Oh, button. <gasps> Has Nanaki told you anything about his parents yet? Nope. They were watchers, both of them. But they couldn't have been any more different. When our village came under attack, my mother fought with courage, with honor. She faced the enemy and laid down her life to save us. My father, though, he turned tail and ran. He was a coward. I'm listening, I swear. You still haven't forgiven him. Why would I? I see. We're going really far down here. Okay. <laughs> From this point onward, only two may proceed. Mm. He who shall undertake the trial and his observer. Can I choose? Who's gonna observe? I'll do Please it. Please let me. <laughs> that would render the trial meaningless. But if not him. Ah, you do nicely. That's who I was gonna choose. Him? Really? At least pretend not to hate me. <laughs> <laughs> Whenever you're ready. Ready. Hell yeah. Can I thank you? Should I reset this stuff? 
Do I have all the Barrett Red 13 stuff? Damn. Tifa and Red. I'm not like abandoned, you say. We got we got fire and ice healing revival wind empowerment I don't think I need prayer I haven't been using it precision defense that might come in handy prayer might come in handy too Large AG boost when guarding MP up. Poison petrify, maybe? I think I'm gonna do petrify. Yeah. Alright. And then fire material earrings. Probably change those out. For assess material. Yes. much better. That's better. Can I make any more things with the trains? I can. I Damn, that's a lot. Exquisite beast hide is the thing that's been holding me back. Go through and make sure I get the rest. Put that on there. Put that. Well, no, I don't need that. That one and that one. Okay. Let me save. This menu just seems really dark. You gonna watch my back? Yeah. Burning holes in this right there. <laughs> what is this? This is a place of deep sorrow. A place where those who have been seen away are left to mourn their fates. Snake-like creatures that slither, slither in caves, they possess venomous fangs that can poison their prey either by uh, spitting toxic, uh, biting or spitting in toxic secretion, exploiting their elemental weakness to pressure them. Fire. Want some more? 
Oops. My turn. Kind of miss your other voice. Not gonna lie. Look here. It's fine. Wall should be well within it's your right. power to climb. It makes sense. They're like 45 in dog years, but they're only like 15, 16. Especially with like the age of everyone else, kind of makes sense. Uh, approaching glowing surfaces using the left stick to scamper along the walls. Pressing. Some moving your pressure will drop. But to remember, watch where you land. What? Excuse me? Oh. Weird. Okay. Wild. Hmm. This place has given me the creeps. Your discomfort is only natural. A fierce battle is waging. And even after 45 years, scars remain fresh. What? You're saying the Gi managed to make it all the way up here? <laughs> okay, somebody fill me in. Who are the Gi? The tribe knows a very few people outside of the thing. The rest you will learn in due time. Of that you can be certain. For now. Let us proceed. Isn't this the thing that uses shrine? Quadrupedal, quadrupedal, uh, Arthropods. I can't even say that word. They scurry around caves. They stabilize themselves by plunging their hind legs into the ground, allowing them to unleash devastating attacks, exploding their elemental weakness, or pressure them. No. These are the enemies that, in PS1, you walk through the spider web and you have to fight them. Yes. Ouch. Got two legs here, you know. Damn, if that doesn't look convenient. It is. It is quite convenient. Really? Did I do good or did I do good? 
spear me, bring it home? I don't know. I'll... Kind of dig the the whole like fuck you voice. But it's fine. It's not a big deal. I still get to play as red. Whoa. Why would I jump up here? To go across? Why would I go across? There's gotta be a reason to come up here. Or not. Boo, okay. Alright. Hey, where'd you run off to? Did that hit the enemy? Please tell me that hit the enemy. Damn it. Damn it, that doesn't look convenient. We've been through this before. It is. Wasn't anything up there, right? Yeah, you told me. Are these even worth getting? Unable to obtain. Uh, obtained. Unable to obtain. And now that's everything. things the things and stuff the stuff and things Barrett it's convenient I know hey where'd you run off to they're gonna tell me about your legs again close do, 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 do. this level kind of doesn't hit for me at all celestial bengal it's not a color right it's bengal god damn Ooh, 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 yeah. Elemental, you say? Level boost, you say? Throw on a level boost. Spirit up, lock up. This 
should be I haven't ran up this yet. I only got two legs here, you know. Yes, but yes, I do know. Okay. Did we see the Turks in in here? I don't think so, right? Hey, where'd you run off to? Time worn talisman. around here somewhere. I already have one of those. Spirit. We can take him. Come at ya. It's over. Come and get me. Sick of it. All right. Watch and learn. I've got something to do. You've got this. All right. My time to shine. Here goes. You got this. Work is never done. circumstances, I would stress that you uh, mustn't judge a book by its cover. For the Gi, however, they are as fearsome as their appearance implies. These are the things that killed my mom? Nanaki, this shall be your first trial. You are to explore this place. Understand the nature of its history. Okay, will do. Oh shit. Seek the relic of our past. Carry it forth and bring the truth to light. Only then shall the path reveal itself unto you. Yourself to near an object to grab it with your mouth and release the button. To drop it, hit initiating combo walls. You should automatically drop held item. Grab the Gi artifacts. Scattered around the cavern, ask Wiganhagen to inspect them. Okay. If you say so. Alright. I'm down. I didn't see any coming down this way, so I'm assuming they're in this room. this one okay so I have to guess I'm not sure but I'm pleased to see that you're enjoying yourself you know
Okay, never mind. I'm gonna make a guess. I'm gonna make an educated guess. It's probably not a bone. So far, it's a spear looking thing. This for sure is it. I was gonna bring all of them here. Cause we're still getting in a fight. Get rid of that thing! <laughs> oh shit. Spirits of the Geeth that perished during the invasion of Cosmo Canyon now cursed uh, Tonda. Its caverns. Uh, they were sealed underground, lest the uh, I can't I can't read. They were sealed underground, uh, lest they unleash their deep-seated hatred upon innocents. So, polluting their elemental weakness with magic attacks or hitting them with healing spells will pressure them. You just straight up tell me that. All right. Even with strong range physical attacks while they're, uh, while they're doing this, what? They spin their spears to deflect all ranged attacks, hitting them with strong close range physical attacks when they're doing this with pressure. They will not remain dead long as Gi Sorcerer is present. Okay. Curious. That spectre you fought was a fallen key. Even in death, their lingering enmity manifests as such. They who wander in search of retribution. That's kind of pathetic. Do not be so quick to denigrate your enemies nor make light of their plight. Consider this statue. It has been placed in this chamber for a reason. Handle it with the utmost care. I will. Deliver yeah. unto us the remnants of our past. Hmm. Now this level's getting cooler. Gonna break the other ones first. What did I get? You just told me to get that. Okay. Exquisite beast times. I think the cape. Get it out of the way. Boop, 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 boop. 
ドゥルルルルルドゥルドゥルルルルルルルルルルルルルルルルルルルルルルルルルルルルルルルルルルルルルルルルルルルルルルルSo where does this one go? Looks like the red one. You, you have a oh. It's gonna Mommy, say you have a rancor. Daddy loves you. That it? Not in the least. Do 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 do. Uh huh. Shut the fuck up. It is very convenient. Barrett's gonna tell me about legs. Very soon. You watch. No? Alright. Well, hello. I'm trying to get this picture. I need to move quick. Not quite. No? What was getting you to look up? I'm sorry, I keep pausing. Yeah, you looked up there. Red, look up. I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna do this. I'm gonna get this. That was perfect.
There we go. There's something I can work with. jog and look straight up at them. No. No! One more time, I swear. Come on, come on. You go like that. So if I come over here... There's going to be like tons of these statues around and I'm just messing with the first one that I saw. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. leg through the fucking tail. Kind of leg it to the right. Don't know what it is. Let me go down a little bit more, you bitch. I can flip it in post. Let me go the other way. not. Maybe it was the right angle to go to the right. works. Here. 
<laughs> oh god. That's right. Beer doesn't have, you know, it's not convenient. Forgot. Should have reminded me like 30 more times. First came to these lands many millennia ago. Mm. This sanctuary is proof of their persistence, for it was built to ensure that they never escaped. But if they were sealed away thousands of years ago, how'd they break out and attack the veil? Vale? That I cannot answer. Only the key themselves could. But enough about them. You are here to learn about yourself, Malaki. This cave serves as a boundary between our world and that of the Gi. It was vital to them and their plans. Were the Gi to seize control of it, the canyon would be doomed. And the people. When the Gi moved against us yet again, a certain watcher recalled this vulnerability. Huh? Since time was of the essence, he entered the cave without reinforcements. As he had feared, it was teeming with Gi, ready to descend upon the village. Determined to protect the way, he pounced from one foe to the next, felling all who dared oppose him. Hold on. If there was a watcher who single-handedly saved the canyon, how come I've never heard of them? <laughs> For now, you should focus on your own struggles with the key. Their malice grows more potent. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Holy crap. Well then. What the hell? It's definitely good. I'm beyond. Do not allow fear to take hold of your heart. You are your own master, Manaki. You and no one else. Never forget mm -hmm. that. Look to the crevasse and the gates beyond. Pass through all to complete your trial. But that's easier said than done. First beings that float in caves, they were once masked, uh, masks using gi rituals. They've since become possessed by their owners overwhelmingly... Overwhelmingly... Enmity? En en enmity? I don't know what that means. Uh, one side shows a pleasant smile, while the other shows a ter terrible anger. They can pressured uh, when suggesting their opponent take a gamble. Hitting them with a powerful offensive ability at this time will also spin the roulette, enhancing the uh, enhancing or enfeebling assailant. Okay, okay. That's arrow. That's not gamble. Gamble. That seems like an enhancement to me. button 
questions. Ain't got nothing on me. Neat. I'm gonna be real. Be real, right? This area is the sewers. This is the water level. I I am not not a fan. It's fun game. What do you mean? Ooh. Ooh. Charging. Yeah. Yeah, I'm not a fan of this level. I don't know. I maybe I had high hopes. Just so far, I'm not digging it. I love the visuals. It looks nutty. Keep it in the wrong one. Can't see shit. Ether, okay. We've entered Kaled. Lead, Caleb, whatever it is. Why? Why? Why have that there? It's weird. Bazooka? <laughs> More damage. Ability critical hit rate up. Damage and percent. Had another one? Well, but I lose the link on the top. It's okay. It's alright. Synergy support. And maybe. Morph? I don't know why I ever would. A DB boost could be kind of clutch. What, what ability was that? Smackdown. Direct the ground to send uh, nearby enemies flying. So how are we supposed to open this thing? How indeed? I 
<laughs> Super simple, just like that. Very strong. The strongest. Mm -hmm. I can pull rope. I think I don't like this area because I've already um, have my character set the way that I want. So instead of feeling like I've got all these crazy abilities and stuff that I can do, I'm limited to just Barret and Red. And it's making me feel like it's end up 16 combat. I'm just doing the same things over and over and over again because that's what gets the best, you know, damage. Whoa, oops. How do I learn that? Oh, just by using it, I guess. Strike two or more enemies. Smackdown is nice. Smackdown is very nice. to be turned to stone. Okay, go let's go. Need my help, send you around the world and back. Ah, You're up. Leave it to me. Gotcha. Gotcha. Did I do good or did I do good? Honest stuff. How do we get turned around? Here. Whoa, when you run into other people, the right trigger- why? Why tr right trigger rumbles? Yeah. <laughs> oh, there's three of them here. Due to broken fastener? I wonder what I need to do. Damn. Crazy. Do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do. <laughs> Don't 
Archer, Lancer, Sorcerer. Cool, I got them all. Seven mega potions and they're not doing jack all anymore. How many ether do we got? Thirteen? Way too much. Way too much. is much more ancient and serves a rather different purpose. The altars we came upon before were built to imprison the key. This, however, was built to provide the Sephra with a means to commune with them. Commune with them? Why would the Sephra do that? The Gi were the enemy. <laughs> Good and evil friend and foe. My cotton is not set in stone. As beautiful as the wind is. But for now, Anaki, let us concentrate on the matter at hand. Clearing a path to the truth. Mm hmm. Only got two legs here, you know. Thanks for letting me know. I appreciate it, Barrett. Probably stuff up there. Hey, where'd you run off to? Damn, secret bite. Materia that I don't need. Oh, it's just me. Let him know. What the? 
Well, they're back, eh? Out here, fuck that. I only got two legs here, you know. Shut up, Barrett. You and your fucking legs. I only got two legs, you know. I know, I know you do. Can I not? Oh. You don't say, Bugenhagen. Sit, bread, sit. Thank you. Seems like he's gonna uh, suck. Feels like it anyway. Spirit up. Wind magic focus. I haven't been using wind at all. But rather do petrify maybe. Let's get in here. See what's up. Let's see what happens. Explains a lot. That explains a ton. That would be such dope. Uh, eh. Eh. The leader of the Gi. Uh, people who were driven to extinction and cursed to roam as spirits, projected to the uh, by the livestream. He and his clan have uh, been sealed in an underground cave left 
to phantom flames of their hatred and red miasma that envelops them. Inflicting enough damage for pressure, a curse uh, will activate when the soul possesses a statue. Oh god. Red, half HP, purple, half MP, green, deplete ATB, yellow, shrink, battlefield? Spoiler. Uh, staggering Gi and Talk will undo the curse. Doom will be inflicted, uh, will inflict instant death after a certain amount of time. Oh, great. Cool. Alright, yeah. Barrett, why'd you use that? If I remember correctly. It did work. Immune resisted. This is where this comes in play. Okay. Okay. Fair enough. Of course you can. Of course you can. Where's a grenade? Damn it. You cheating son of a bitch. Come on, come on. 
music. I thought it was cool. I thought it was really cool. Form evanescent, rancor everlasting. We listen to that song again. That well that, done. that was dope. You've become quite the formidable fighter. <laughs> sure have. So does this mean I passed the test? <laughs> oh. I'm afraid that decision is not mine alone to make. <sighs> Let us consult with one more qualified. Well, I wonder who that might be. Hmm? Is your orb mechanical? The Watcher of the Vale fought valiantly and offered up his life in defense of our home. As you see, he still watches over us to this very day. Wait, is that... Seto? My father? No, there's no way. The poisoned arrows of the Gi transformed his body into stone. And there he has stood ever since, his watch eternal. Our savior. What about my mom? Did she know what had happened to him? Oh, oh, oh. Why, of course she did. 
It was, after all, she and Seto who asked me to see her off the cave. But why? Why did she never tell me the truth? Because she knew that if she did, you would attempt to seek your father out all by yourself. Your parents strove to keep our veil safe. But there is one thing they fought even harder to protect. You, Nanaki, their son. She was afraid because I was too small and weak. <laughs> Back then, perhaps, but not anymore, heavens no. You've become a fine warrior in your own right. And that is precisely why I brought you here. <laughs> but this is not where your journey is meant to end, my dear boy. You must no. leave the veil once more. I'm a watcher now. I gotta protect our home like he did. Listen to me, Mama Ki. When I first heard your friend's emphatic warnings, I dismissed them outright. No more than the ravings of misguided youths. When you've lived as long as I have, you start to believe you've seen it all. But no surprises remain. But I realize now how very foolish I have been. The eyes that I thought saw the world clearly have grown blind to new possibilities. But... I would hate to impede your progress any further. I bid you leave, Nanaki. Before, like me, you become inured to your own ignorance. With sharper eyes and keener ears, go forth and in my stead seek the great truths of our world. Look after him for me. Don't worry, we will. You failed this trial, my boy. Continue your training and try again. Are you up to the task, Nanaki? You bet I am. After all... No. I am Nanaki, watcher of Cosmo Canyon. Son of Seto, protector of our veil. No. Yeah, put on the glasses. I need to do the same. Excuse me. Hearken unto me. My name is Guy Natak. Oh, brave and noble Seto. I beseech you once more. Hear the urgent pleas of my people. My thanks, Seto. You are as magnanimous as ever. The warrior Nanaki. And you, the Setra. What? Oh, an exciting turn of events indeed. 
We'll back you up for two thousand. Uh. <laughs> no. This one's free. Within that piece flashes a tumult of emotion. See to it that Nanaki remains safe. Oh, oh, well, oh, we'll do. Oh. Our world is filled with wonders. I bid you seek them out. We will escort fellow Bugenhagen back home. Take care, friends. If you can handle those giant spider things, go for it. I'm going to change my party. So, this is new, so I don't feel like I need to have red. Red's cool and all. What? No. Boop, 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 boop. Edit party? There we go. Can anyone explain to me why we're even taking this detour? Anyone? Because some of us are on a mission to secure the material we need to, you know, save our homeland. How can you talk like that in a place like this? I'm scared out of my wits here. I don't know. This bee dude's too nice to freak me out. He may act nice, but who knows what he's planning. Stay alert. <laughs> the home of the Gi lies beyond. Now let us begin our journey. Not so fast. What's in it for us? Unless it's Materia, you can count me out. How strange you should mention Materia. My people are also in search of it. <laughs> okay, all aboard. Would have stayed longer if I could, but I'll be back soon. Great, the boat's made out of bones. Sick. swaying with the rocking of the boat i want to move less not more <laughs> didn't seem to mind when you jumped aboard well, only because he mentioned materia <laughs> be quiet the planet is listening and what's wrong with that anything that reaches the planet's ears in due time reaches those of the cetera Unfortunately, the Cetra are not a tolerant people. Excuse me, am I intolerant too? I'm Cetra. <laughs> you are indeed one of them, by lineage alone. You know not of their history. That has been lost to time. Their history? Consider your ignorance a blessing. The Cetra's past is fraught with horror and sorrow. Yeah, tell me more. Red Moon type shit. Tell me more. I want to know. I'm still on my theory bullshit. So there I am, on the ground, bleeding out, watching everything go dark. 
thinking, this is it. This is how it ends. Only, it isn't. Suddenly, the wind picks up out of nowhere. It tugs at me so hard, it feels like it's tearing my soul right out of my body. So this big snows are cloud. Tell me who found me or how I got there. It's a miracle. Sounds like what happened to me. Whole freaking army unloading on my position. I'm feeling every single force. I'm outnumbered, and the next, I'm alone. None of it makes any sense. Huh. I somehow managed to beat the odds and wake up here, alone. Why in the hell did fate pick me? Can't think that way. <laughs> Can't not think that way. Their luck runs out, but mine doesn't. I'm the only one who gets a pass. <laughs> and now that it's just me, what am I supposed to do? You know? Yeah, I get it. Hey, come with me. Sure, but why? I'll explain on the way. Do we get a control or is it okay? Cool, 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 cool. Two green materia still. Still Midgar, yeah. Just trying to figure out where the hell we are. Okay, yeah. This is, uh, the school. Huh. So, how's Cloud holding up? Mako Poisoning's done a real number on him. Doubt he's in for a speedy recovery either. But hey, hope springs eternal. Right. <laughs> if he does recover, you can bet your ass he'll act like it was nothing. Shrug it off and say he's been through ten times that shit. Are we talking about the same cloud? If the Come on. Are down, the guy's desperate to prove himself. Not like he needs to. Everyone knows he's a bona fide badass. So this is... Hey, the why don't you try picking up some work as a merc? A sack of all trades. Why? Because one's not enough. I don't know what to think about it. Shinder's gonna try to attack the rift. Is it true? Oh, how she cries. Her lamentations echoing from sea to sea. All the reactors stopped working. Get a load of this. <laughs> okay, let's see. The destruction of Sector 7 was orchestrated by Shinra themselves. We can't let those murderers get away with it. 
People of Midgar fight back against our corporate oppressors by joining Avalanche. Seek us out at the lot off Petal Lane. Wow, that's bold. Yep. These guys are setting a trap for themselves. Shinra will just roll in and round them all up. Doubt public security will even bother going through the motions. Easier just to shoot and skip the paperwork. Then anyone who goes is... An idiot, I know. But idiots are what we need right now. Folks will risk it all. Wait, don't tell me you're going. The things I do for friends. <laughs> Probably still terrifying. Hey, you ever wondered about your purpose in life? What you're doing here? Sure, from time to time. Or all the time. Would never have guessed. Didn't used to, it's but things changed. Went through a lot after I joined up. Shinra, like we only have ourselves a lot. To blame. I bet. I ask, because ever since I woke up, I've been wondering about what to do with all this time I've been given. Mm -hmm. Hey, Biggs. You said before I ought to try picking up some work as a merc. Yeah. Because one's not enough. So who's the one? <laughs> Cloud. He didn't tell you? Must not have wanted the competition. When exactly did you meet Cloud? The day before we hit Reactor 1. So... Uh, how long ago was that again? <laughs> Weird. My internal clock's busted. Yeah, mine too. What's that about anyway? <laughs> Good question. Damn it. What's gonna happen to our baby? Don't know. I just wish we could have seen their face. Hey, let's give them a name. We may not know what's gonna happen, but I want to call them by their name at least. I like that. We'll give them a name, and we'll be a family. I have so much I used to get so hung up on the, the name. stuff. How are you gonna spend your final days? If this is gonna be our last. I think I prefer being number two or three. Suits me much better. Yeah. Why don't we all go? Like the guy who only has to worry about the how, doesn't have to decide on the what. A minor role? Exactly. I'm no hero. So how come I was the one who got saved? Because someone needs you. You and your can-do attitude. Then who might that be? Uh, you were the guy with Eric. Whoever He's brought there, you right? back, and I guess. And assuming there was someone, who could it have been? <laughs> That's Come a on, good everyone. question. It'll be okay. For the longest time, she tried to keep her part-time work. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Hell with it. Let's just do what we want. Start by robbing folks and stocking up on kill. Quit it. You're not fooling anyone. Shut up. Once we're loaded, we can drown ourselves in booze. You're scared. It's just up ahead. Keep your eyes peeled. Copy. Or the place we've already been a thousand times? Oh. Hmm? Nobody, huh? Not a soul. Well... At least Shinra was a no-show too, right? Who's there? <laughs> right? Hmm? Huh. New recruit? Makes sense. Uh, as if I'd ever join Avalanche! I just came to see what kind of morons would fall for your dumbass propaganda, that's all. But I should have known. Nobody could be that stupid. <laughs> anyway, I'm out, losers. 
I told you I wasn't cut out for a leading role. And here I thought I might have been saved for a reason. Some higher purpose. Sorry for wasting your time. Okay, I thought that was like Cloud's mom. I was like, what the fuck? What, what is happening? Biggs! It's up to us to find our own purpose. I mean, who says it's gotta be one way? Everyone's sitting back, acting like the world's doomed, but the future's not set in stone. We're not powerless. So long as we don't lose sight of what's important. <sighs> you know, what matters most of all when the going gets tough. I don't know, hopes, dreams, maybe? Something like that. So long as we've got those. And hold on tight and never let go. Like this? Like, like your life depends on it. <laughs> <laughs> the world's lucky to have you. It's a start. Hmm. Anyway, I gotta run. I'll be sure to pay a visit to Cloud when I get the chance. See ya. Think about what I said. Yeah, they're just gonna sum it up to if Cloud does come I guess I out of it. Probably at home too. He just bumped his head too hard, got too much po maca poisoning, I don't know. Oh, huh. Hmm. Wait, do I have to go there? Can I keep exploring? God damn it. Guess who I just saw? Biggs. Really? Uh. Said he'd visit, too. Oh, yay! <laughs> Did he say anything about Daddy or Tifa? Oh, uh, sorry. Forgot to ask. Aww. <laughs> Zach, would you mind checking on Aerith for me? Sure. We're all headed for the same place. You'll see your daddy and Tifa again. Soon? Don't say soon. Don't say soon. That's soon fucked up. Oh, God soon damn.
We've arrived. Oh, this is getting wild. Creepy. Damn. 